da, da, da. Randy! Yeah! Where are you, bud? I'm in here, bud! What are you doing, bud? Didn't you remember I was coming? I remembered you were coming. Well, do you want me to wait or something, bud? Like, are you good? No, I'm good. This is my special day. It's my day off. What, are you, what the hell are you doing? I'm just shaving my chest, bud. I have, you know, on my special days, I like to have a bath, I get some suds going, and today is my cheat day. I'm on, you know, taking better care of myself and you know, just trying to eat better. So once a week, I'm allowed to eat whatever I want. So I got myself some burgers and onion rings and chicken fingers, and it's going to be a good feast. But, uh, in but, the tub? Yeah, man. Look, I got my tray. Everything's all set up. Well, all right, man. We got everything here, but I really, I got to get these done, so... Well, give here. them to me. I'll oh, do them right here. here. I don't here. care. It's here. It's Jeez, here. I mean, Frig, you're the one that's late. Sorry. So these are the questions right Those here, are the eh? questions. Well, I don't want to get these all... Oh. No, we'll hang them on your little hooky there. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Okay. Perfect. There we go. See? It's perfect. It is perfect. All right. Well, let me just... This is the hard part. So well, let's just see what these questions are. All right. So the first question here we got from John John Doe. John John Doe huh, could be like someone with money, get it? Doe or Play-Doh or something. Um, John John Doe says, Afternoon Bobandy. Well, it's friggin' morning. He's fucking stupid. How do you feel about not living with your greasy son? Do you miss him at all? What in the fuck? John John, don't you frig off, man. That's pretty personal information. I don't, this is my special day. I'm not even gonna... Bother answering that shit. I'm just, I'm getting all cleaned up here. Shaving and I'm going to have my cheat day feast. You can frig off. Stop talking about my son. All right? Stop wishing me good afternoon when it's morning. Frig off, John John Doe. Doe head. That's what it is. Friggin' doe head. Doe head someone with like doughy brains. You know what I mean, man? I know. Why don't you just move on to the next one, bud? All right, just suck. All right, second question is from Kathy Corbett. Kathy Corbett says, Randy, why are you so sweet to people who judge you? Jeez, Kathy, that's a good question. You know, like, people, people are always judging me. But, you know, I think, seriously, you're supposed to, like, take life. And, and if you match those people judging you with goodness, it makes you a better person. And, and you know, what goes around comes around. So if you're good to people that are judging you even a bad way, you know, maybe it'll be good for you someday. Like, who knows, you might get a free burger or something. That's, I think it's better to be nice, really. Tell you what, this nipple part is hard. Here, just a sec here. We got a second, right? Sure. It's always good to do a little rinse down and oxifying or something to keep your chest from breaking out. That's what you do. Oxification or something they call it, I think. You know what I mean? I guess, bud. Yeah. Alright, see? Fucking good job. Okay. I like the side, so. I'll do, I'm going to have one more question, and then I'm going to have something to eat, bud. Because, okay. uh, you know, it's, uh, it's about me. Okay, so this is from C.J. Pullman. And Pullman is spelled with a P-O-H-L. I think the H is silent. So C.J. Pullman. Randy, if you had a, to choose between the last double bacon cheeseburger in the world or spend the last day on earth with Mr. Leahy, which one would you choose and why? Well, how the hell do you know it's the last day on earth anyway there, CJ? I, who, they said in 2012 it was going to be the last day, and, you know, it, it wasn't, right? So, in this case, I think what I'd do is probably take the cheeseburger, because chances are you're going to get another day. And if you get another day, then you can, you know, spend another day with Mr. Leahy at that time. But if you, life offers you a cheeseburger... You fucking take it. And that's what I'm going to do right now, CJ. It was a very good question, I think. But right here, I've got a beautiful burger. It's got some bacon and shit on it, right? See? You got bacon, 
double cheese, right? But remember, sometimes it's better to add all food groups, right, to the burger. So I'm taking it off. Onions are good. That's a little crazy on the onion right there. Take some of that shit off, right? That's too much. Put that on the side. Just keep a couple on there. But this is prime time chance to add some onion rings to your burger like that, right? A little bit more ketchup because onion rings are good on ketchup. This is, this is going to be a good feast, man. I'm fucking sorry to eat this right in front of you, but now you're probably hungry. This right? kind of looks a little gross, actually, but... What are you talking about? Onion rings are awesome. So you put those on. And I got some of these, uh, where the fuck are they? Those are rings. Chicken, chicken fingers are always good too, because you get a couple different types of, of meat on your burger. Get your chicken finger on there, and you see it, notice how the fat ends there, so you put it this way, so it makes a perfect, see how perfect that is? How it fits, like that. And a bit of mayonnaise, man. Chocolate. Tough bitch, this one. Sometimes the mayonnaise, you know, they don't want to go on it going bad on you. I think that's fucking. It's hard when you're in the tub, and sometimes it's good to have your washcloth. And you can wash, wash off your hand, and then. Fuck, man. Maybe this one's easier. Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah. There. Put some mayonnaise on your chicken fingers because that gives it a bit more moisture. Right? And then this is the magic. A little bit of sweet and sour sauce. Put that right on top. Like that. See, when you combine salty and sweet, save some. I've got more burgers. i got to save some. Okay. Now... A few french fries on there because these have got starch and some carbohydrates and you put them on there it's good now that that is a big motherfucker right there man. that's well that see then you gotta lean over you don't want it to fall in the tub mmm mmm That's good, man. Oh, okay. Okay, we got to get back to some questions. Okay, okay. man. Sorry, man. Hey, you can hey. eat as you do. I know. I'm interrupting your special All time. Right. But. Okay, so next question here is from Wild Bill. Wild Bill says, Randy, which is the better way to mow a proper lawn? In straight lines or diagonal lines? Straight stripes or diagonal lines? Well, Truth of the matter is, there, Wild Bill, you gotta mow the lawn differently every time. That way, it doesn't get all fucked. So, and it also is great when you're stoned to try to do something different. Like the diagonal lines are cool. Try squares. Squares are fucking keep getting smaller and smaller, and you end up in the middle with a little square. Can you mow it? You're done. I've tried to do crop circles, and people just told me to freak off. They want, want the whole lawn done. Yeah. Okay. Um, Eric Rose. Randy, why do you keep going back to Leahy when it's obvious he really he's really in love with Julian? Well, I don't really know if that's true there, fucking Eric. I mean, I think he thinks Julian's sexy. Everyone... Ah, oh, fuck, the chicken finger fell out, man. You gotta push it in. I mean, Julian's handsome and sexy, but, you know, he's not the type of guy that's really good at loving people. Mmm. Fuck. That was a good burger. So, I don't know. I think secretly, maybe he thinks that Julian's sexier than me. I don't know why. I mean, I've got a shaved chest, and... I look good, but 
I'd say that he's probably has a deep love for me and, and a bit of a sexual attraction to Julian, which is the way things are in the world, you know? People are sexually attracted to everything these days. All right, I hope that answers your question, Eric, you fucker. Okay, uh, this one's from uh, James Hopper. Hey, Ramban, do you think you would ever become friends with the boys again? Make peace, team up against Leahy. He's cocked you over a few times, too. You know, well, that's true. Well, uh, I don't know. Yeah. I mean, I think I could be friends with the guys. Like, Ricky's pretty cool. He's always got dope and stuff. And, you know, we usually get along most of the times. And, and Bubbles is good with advice. And Julian's always got liquor. So, I mean, they'd be good good guys to hang out with. And, you know, Mr. Lay does have some liquor surges that, you know, no one really understands. He just fucking goes on and on and on, for fuck's sake. Anyway... Yeah, I could see. I, I I think everyone should have friends. The more friends, the better. You know, like it's just a the world's too small, and sometimes everyone needs a friend. You know, a shoulder to talk to and stuff. All right, let's do one more, bud, and then we're gonna have to come back from part two. This is fucking taking forever. Jeez, okay, for freak's sakes. All right, all right. So this one here is from Cheeseburger Walters. <laughs> The guy's name's Cheeseburger Walrus? That's an offensive name. That's what J-Rock freaking calls me. Oh, the sweet and sour sauce. Man, see, sometimes bacon falls off. Wow, you just get an extra piece. But it would have been too much with these onions. Okay. Cheeseburger Walrus. Randy, who makes the best fast food cheeseburger? Cheeseburger King. Cheeseburger King is the fucking best. I don't know if you guys have ever been there. It just opened up. They give you this huge cheeseburger. It's Every cheeseburger's got three patties. It's like a triple, but they just call it Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger King. Check them out. Try to find them. I don't know if they can keep doing that, but, you know, that's where this is all from. The Cheeseburger King. And you can make your own shit. If you wanted, you could put, you could put a fucking fish on here or something. And you get... You know, seafood. Look, this burger. 